Related rates, problem six, lengthening shadow problem. A man six feet tall walks at a rate of five feet per second away from a light that is 15 feet above ground, see figure. When he is 10 feet away from the base of the light, A, at what rate is the tip of his shadow moving? B, at what rate is the length of his shadow changing? Stop the lesson and try to solve the problem, then restart the video to see if you got it right. Here we are with our find when given an equation. What are we trying to find? The rate the tip of his shadow is moving. In order to mathematically define that rate, which is the rate the shadow is moving away from the base of the light pole, we'll have to define the distance from the base of the light to the tip of the shadow, and we'll call that distance y. And so the rate of the tip of the shadow moving is the change in y over time, which we'll call dy dt. And when? Well, when the man is 10 feet away from the base of the light. We'll call the distance from the man to the base of the light x. So we'll say this is when x equals 10, as in the man being 10 feet away from the base of the light. And we're given a few items to consider. The height of the lamp is 15 feet. The height of the man is 6 feet. And the rate of the man walking is 5 feet per second. So the 5 feet per second we define as dx dt equals 5 feet per second. So we place the lamp height of 15 feet and the man, man's height of 6 feet in the given category as well. Now for finding the equation. What we have to work with here are two similar right triangles which I will superimpose on our drawing. We have first the blue triangle shown here. And for the second smaller red right triangle, which is similar to the first blue triangle, we have the height equal to the height of the man, 6 feet, and the base of the triangle is y minus x feet. So we use these similar triangles to get our, an equation. The height over base of the blue triangle is equal to the height over the base of the red triangle, and that is 15 over y equals 6 over y minus x and cross multiplying the equation we get 15y minus 15x equals 6y. By adding 15x to and subtracting 6y from both sides of the equation we get 9y equals 15x and solving for y we get y equals 5 thirds x. Implicitly differentiating we get dy dt equals 5 thirds dx dt and substituting 5 feet per second for dx dt, we get dy dt equals 5 thirds times 5 feet per second, which is 25 thirds feet per second, which in mixed number form is 8 and 1 third feet per second. And we box this answer in as our correct answer. Now let's go on to part B. At what rate is the length of his shadow changing? The answer is going to be the rate of the tip of the shadow moving that we got in doing part A of this problem minus the rate the man is walking. The rate the tip of the shadow is moving increases the length of the shadow at the same time that the man walking in front of the lamp decreases that shadow length. So our answer to part B is going to be dy dt minus dx dt. And that equals 25 thirds minus 5 feet per second which, getting our common denominator of 3, is 25 thirds minus 15 thirds feet per second, which equals 10 thirds feet per second, which we box in as our answer, which is 3 and 1 third feet per second in mixed number form. This has been Related Rates Problem 6, Lengthening Shadow Problem. Thanks for viewing.